express to you what I'm feeling right now. My heart is full to bursting, except to say, I'm the king of So I got a film camera. It's the first time I've ever purchased a film camera before. And I got the Yashica T4. This is the T-proof, so maybe it's the T5. I'm not exactly sure. I think there's like four different versions of the same camera. I know that this camera specifically has been popularized by like Terry Richardson and Gunnar Stahl. And so because of that, the price of them is really high but I was watching a lot of videos from like Willem Verbeck and Vlandis. I don't know if I'm saying either of their names correctly, but uh, I've been watching a lot of their videos. I just liked the way that the film photos looked. A couple of my friends out here who you've seen in the videos maybe before, Dennis and JP, they both have film cameras that they kind of take with them wherever they go. And so I like that they have a camera that they can just fit in their pocket and like bring with us wherever we're going and it's not like a burden to carry around like one of these cameras would be. So basically I wanted a camera that I could fit in my pocket for the most part. It was really easy to carry around, had a flash on it. With this, I feel like I would get better pictures than what I would with my iPhone. I'm just gonna carry it around with me for the next like week or so and see how the pictures turn out. So let's go get some film. I hope it works. Okay, it's really early in the morning. I've been growing the beard for like a month now. But it's starting to just get like a little, like whiskery. I think it's time has come. So I'm gonna shave and I'm gonna film Mallory's reaction to seeing me for the first time in like a month, clean shaven. Are you ready? Oh my goodness, our noodle again. It's <laughs> <laughs> me out actually. Not that I really look at it. You don't like it? No, like I do, but it's, uh, and like your smile's so prominent. I think I look creepy. I just think it needs to be in the sun for like a couple hours. Oh, I think that looks sweet. I look weird, I have pink hair. We're going to Catalina Island today. Catalina! <laughs> Just beat Mallory at Cup Pong. That's where the Sweet Life of Zach and Cody was filmed. Sweet Life on deck. I love the camera. It checks every box that I was hoping that it would. For example, Mallory and I went to Atlanta for a wedding. Didn't want to bring this big camera with me. So 
brought this camera. We went out with the wedding party the night before and the day of the wedding, before the ceremony, during the ceremony, the reception, and all the pictures just look really nice. I put the camera in my suit jacket pocket and then every time I wanted to take a picture, just pop it out. Only have to press one button. I don't have to worry about settings. I just look, click it and it's done. And I could kind of do the same thing with my iPhone, but I just think that these pictures look way better than the type of picture that I would get off of my iPhone. I just think the colors look so much better, like the lens itself, I guess maybe because it's a 35 millimeter, it looks more like portrait, whereas an iPhone looks just like really wide angle. I don't know, I just think the pictures look a lot better than an iPhone. And in a scenario like this where I don't wanna bring a big camera around. I get these really nice looking pictures that look like they were shot, to me at least, they look like they were shot on like a professional camera. They were just shot on this that I can just fit in my pocket. Another example, Mallory and I went to Universal a couple weeks ago over in Studio City. We just decided to randomly go for the day. Couldn't bring this camera in even if I wanted to because they have rules about like detachable lenses or whatever, so. This camera works, got really nice looking pictures. In my opinion, better than any iPhone picture that I would have tried to take that day. Mallory with her butterbeer here. An encounter we had with a real life dinosaur. Mallory being really silly at Super Silly Funland. Her with the stuffed animal from Despicable Me that I won her. We got him here, his name is Rupert. I even went home last weekend for my dad's 50th birthday and Father's Day. Brought this little guy with me, didn't even pack this camera. Hung out with my friends a little bit, went to the beach with my family, took some really great looking pictures. And I think because I have this camera, I look for opportunities to take pictures a lot more than I would with an iPhone because with my phone, I just feel like even if I try to take a good looking picture, it's just gonna look like an iPhone picture, so I don't really care to take it but because I have this with me and I know the picture is gonna look nice, I look for more opportunities to take pictures. Whereas if I didn't have this with me and I just had my iPhone, I probably wouldn't have even taken a picture while I was there. I've even brought this with me on a couple of shoots, which you will see in an upcoming video. But I think even in like a more professional setting, the pictures still hold up really well. It just perfectly fits into those scenarios where I don't wanna bring a big camera around like this, but I do wanna take a few pictures just to have them for memories. I'm really happy I bought it and very excited to keep shooting on it. Let me know what you think of the pictures, if you think they look better than an iPhone or not. I personally think they do, but let me know what you think. That's it for this video.